So last year I made a video on how to stick text to an object, a simple tracking tutorial for DaVinci Resolve. But that was static text. What if you want... Okay, what if you want to use animated text using the same method? Well, that won't work. I mean, the tracking will work, but the animation of the text won't. So let me show you how to fix that and where you can find Resolve's built-in text templates in the Fusion page or third-party text animations. I get mine from Motion VFX, for example. If you're interested, the link is in the description. They offer really cool stuff. And then one more thing, I found out how to do this, how to fix this by experimenting because I couldn't find a tutorial on YouTube. So I don't know if this is the best way to do it, the official way, but it works. It's fast, it's easy, and yeah, it works. But if you know a better way to do it, just let me know in the comments and I guess I'll delete this video then, maybe? I don't know, here we go. Okay, so this is our clip and the first thing you should do, the most important thing to make this work is convert the clip to a fusion clip. Just right click on your video clip and then select new fusion clip. And then with your clip selected and the playhead over the clip, go to the fusion page. Then hit shift plus spacebar, type in tracker and add a tracker node. That's what we're going to use to track the object. If it doesn't connect automatically in between the media in and out node, just connect it manually. Then select the tracker node, put this little tracker box over the object you want to track. Make sure the playhead down here is all the way at the beginning of the clip and then hit track forward. Et voila, tracking complete. And then, instead of adding a text node here, that's what I did in the video last year, you go to Effects, up here, and then Templates, Edit, Titles. This is where you can find all the built-in Resolve animated titles, but also the one you install from third-party websites. My Motion VFX titles, for example, my Motion VFX plugins, they're all here. And then, well yeah, just select one, drop it here, connect it like this, and it's not showing now because I have to do one last thing, one last important thing. Select the tracker node again, then up here go to operation and set it to match move. And that's it. And of course you can reposition it if you want just by dragging it around, but now the animation works. And that's it. Um, no outro rambling this time because I want this to be my shortest video ever.